The following has been developed by state and provincial agencies in association with the Agency for Instructional Television. Together, serving education. I'll meet you there in an hour. Where are you going? To the bank. All right. One hour. That's noon on the button. OK, now be careful and stay together. See you later. Bye. 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 OK, everybody likes pizza, right? We had it last night. Not for lunch. Oh, come on. It's a great place. What? I told you, pizza paradise. I don't know. Let's stay here. I'll flip you for it. All right. This is heads. And I'll call it. Heads. Heads it is. Two out of three. I don't care. Heads. Heads it is. Let's go. Let me see that coin. It's a two-headed coin. You were certain to win every time. Okay, you win. But let's go to Pizza Paradise anyway. That wasn't fair. You'll get some coins, too. We will? Yeah. You get one every time you come in. You collect the letters until you have enough to spell out Pizza Paradise. One more letter, just one, and we win a free trip to Wonder World for our whole family. What are we waiting for? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> open yet? I don't know. What time is it? My watch has stopped. David, why don't you go see if they're open yet? Why don't you? I'm not finished. I know. We'll draw straws for it. Draw straws? What's that? Give me your straws. I'll show you. I'm not done yet. That's okay. Just give me a little part of your straw. Okay. Now we have three long straws and one short one. Whoever picks the short one goes and checks to see if they're open yet. That's easy. OK. Then you can go first. There are four straws, three long and one short. That means I have three chances in four of picking a long straw. 
three straws. I've got two chances out of three to pick a long straw. Saved. Okay, Andy, now it's your turn. It's a 50-50 chance. Just like tossing a coin. A real coin. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll go. The reason King Arthur and his knights had a round table was so that they could decide whose turn it was to fight any challenger who beat upon their door. I challenge anyone who sits at the round table. Oh, that you, Sir Lancelot. Off you go and fight. Are you certain it's me, Your Majesty? Absolutely certain. You're the only one at the round table. Oh, dear. Oh. <coughs> oh. Oh. Why does it always have to be me? Because you're the only choice. Yes, I know, but it still doesn't seem quite fair. No, oh, very well. I'll sit at the round table with you. Divide it in two with Excalibur. And then you'll have one chance out of two of having to fight. Oh, that's better. I challenge anyone who sits at the round table. Yikes. Oh, bad luck, Sir Lancelot. Oh! Oh! oh. 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 <sighs> Couldn't you give me a smaller chance of being picked than one out of two? Very well, if you insist, Sir Lancelot. Three of us will sit with you at the round table. Then you'll only have one chance out of four of having to fight. Oh, that's much better. I challenge anyone who sits at the round table. Not again. Frightfully bad luck, Sir Lancelot, old chap. <laughs> Look, I know I'm the bravest and all that, but I'd still be most grateful if you give me a smaller chance of being picked than one out of four. Is there no pleasing him? As you wish, Sir Lancelot. Nine of us will sit with you at the round table. Then you'll only have a teeny weeny chance of one out of ten of having to fight. Oh, thank you. That's really very good indeed. I challenge anyone who sits at the round table. Oh, no. That's the most incredibly bad luck I've ever seen, Sir Lancelot. <laughs> Why should I always be selected? I can understand being picked when I'm the only one at the table. But when there are two of us at the table, I should have one chance out of two of being picked. And when the table has four knights at it, I should have even a smaller chance of being picked, one out of four. And when the table has ten knights at it, I should have even less of a chance of being picked, one out of ten. Yet, I've been picked every time. Uh, what's this? A, a magnet! <laughs> Transportation and lodging will be paid by Pizza Paradise. Just be the first to spell out Pizza Paradise. You gotta be the first. There are lots of other prizes, but I'm gonna win the biggest. What's that? What's it say? Coin distribution. Something to do with the coins. It means how many of each letter they made. See? Two million P's. Two million I's and Z's, too. The two million of each of them. Except E's. E-60. She's right. That's what it says. Just 60. But there are millions of the others. 
You're never gonna get any if there's only 60 of them in the whole country. I might. It is possible, but not very likely. I don't know, there's 60 E's. I could get one. But look at how many of the others there are. And I thought it was certain that I'd win. Yeah, more like it's certain that I'll lose. It looks that way. You don't have very much of a chance. And I was scrounging these coins out of the parking lot and everything. Well, that's right where I'm gonna throw them. No, wait. What for? They're mine and they aren't good for anything. Yes, they are. Maybe we can win a pizza. Yeah, might as well. Which spinner do you want to try? They're not all the same. How do you win? If the pointer lands on the pizza slice, you win. And you get a pizza. What are these numbers for? It tells you how many coins you have to give them to get a spin. Look at the five coin spinner. Not much chance of winning there. The 10 coin has a bigger slice, a better chance. But look at the 15. It looks like the more coins you spend, the more you improve your chances of winning. Look at the 20 and the 25. The more you spend, the more slices. And the more slices, the better our chances of winning. How many coins do you have? 32. Let's take the best shot, the 25. No. I think you ought to hold out enough to spell Pizza Paradise once. Yeah, who knows? I might even get one of those 60 E's. And I know I have 20 extras. Let's shoot 20. We have a good chance to win. OK. It Figures, a component of the Skills Essential to Learning project, was produced by Maryland Instructional Television under the supervision of the Agency for Instructional Television. <laughs> <laughs>